Now today we are going to discuss chapter number 5 Treasure Island from your literature book. Robert Louis Stevenson wrote Treasure Island in 1881. It is set in the days of sailing ships and pirates and tells of the adventures of Jim Hawkins and his search for the beauty treasure of an evil pirate, Captain Flint. So the first paragraph is a brief introduction itself about lesson Treasure Island and it is a classical adventurous novel written by Robert Louis Stimson in the year 1881. It was written in those days when sailing ships and pirates were in more trend and this story tells about adventures of young Jim Hawkins and his search related for the buried treasure which belonged to an evil pirate named Captain Flint. The Admiral Benbow was an inn that belonged to Jim Hawkins' parents. One day, a mysterious stranger called Billy Bones rented a room at the inn. He warned Jim, keep a look for one-legged man. Some days later, a beggar called Blind Pew visited and gave him a black spot which is the mark of imminent death among pirate crews after Blind Pew left. Billy collapsed and died. Imminent means likely to take place. Crew means the person working on a ship or aircraft. So in the beginning of this lesson, we come to know that young Jim Hawkins, who lives with his parents in an inn named Admiral Bambo. So what happened one day a stranger named Billy Bonds came to rented a room at Jim Hawkins parents in he is a Jim Hawkins here and he is a Billy Bond. Billy Bond warned Jim Hawkins that to keep looking for a one legged man and after some days a beggar called Blind Pew he is a Blind Pew came to meet Billy Bonds and gave him a black spot. Now what is a black spot that is a piece a paper is a black spot and which means an end of leader among pirates. So after getting this piece of black spot Billy fell down and died immediately. Move on to the next paragraph. Jim ran to get his mother. He hastily said to her come quickly help me to search for the map. Both of them searched through Billy's possession and found a map in Billy's sea chest. Shortly after that, Blind Pew returned with a band of evil pirates. So what happened? After the death of the Billy Bonds, Jim Hawkins ran to his mother and called her for a help in search for a treasure map. Jim and his mother started looking for the map from Billy's belonging and they found a map in Billy's sea chest. Now what is the sea chest? Sea chest is a box where Billy Bond used to keep his belongings. After that Blind Pew also returned to the situation with few pirates in search for a map basically that is a treasure map. Jim and his mother quickly hide before the pirates and approach the inn. They ransacked the inn looking for map. Suddenly the soldiers arrived and the pirates escaped. Except for Blind Pew who was accidentally trampled to the death by the soldier's house. Ramsegged means search through from each and every part. Trampled means crushed by. So now what happened? On seeing a group of pirates, Jim Hawkins and his mother hide themselves. They both searched truly for all and in for the treasure map. Beside being pirates and Jim Hawkins, soldiers also arrived on the situation in search for a treasure map. On seeing the soldiers, the pirates left immediately and but the blind pew was crushed by the soldier's house and he died. Jim took the map to Square Tree Landby and Dr. Levisi. They realized that it showed where Captain Flint and Evil and heartless pirate had buried his stolen treasure. So what that Jim Hawkins did after having that piece of paper, that map, treasure map, he straightforwardly went to that person, Dr. Levisi. 
So Dr. Levesi told them that it is that piece of map which can lead them away to the treasure island where Captain Flint used to keep his stolen treasure and he was a heartless person even. So Square and the doctor decided to go and find the treasure and invited him to go along with them. So after that getting a piece of paper that map the treasure map the square and the doctor decided to go for the search of a treasure and even they took Jim Hawkins along with them. They then bought a ship called the Hispaniola and hired a crew led by the respected Captain Smollett. So what they decided the square brought a ship named is Hispaniola and even he brought some crew with the respected Captain Smollett. The ship's cook happened to be a one-legged man called Long John Silver whom everyone admired. So they even hire a cook for their journey and that person is a one-legged man. His name is Long John Silver and he is a that person whom Bill John was talking earlier. One-legged man. The ship set sail and the Captain Smollett became restless. He immediately began to doubt the trustworthiness of his crew. So what happened? As the moment they began their voyage, the Captain Smollett became restless. He did not trust upon his crew members, so he has a, some kind of doubt upon them. However, the night before they reached Treasure Island, Jim overheard Silver and other members of the crew plotting to kill all on the board. Now, so what happened that Jim Hawkins, he was just hiding himself there and he overheard the conversation of these people. He just hear that they are plotting, they are planning to kill all of us on the board before uh, one day they reached to the Treasure Island. He realized that Long John Silver and most of the crew were actually pirates and were once members of Captain Flint's crew. Now, now Jim Hawkins got an idea, got the thought struck in his mind. These people, Long John Silver plus the crew members are the pirate. They are not a crew, they are merely a pirate. And even they were the members of the heartless Flint crew also. Jim said to the doctor, the square and the captains, the crew has evil plans. They are going to kill on board. So after hearing that conversation of the people, Jim Hawkins immediately ran to the doctor, the square and the captain Smollett and informed them about their planning, about the planning of Long John Silver that they decided to kill all of us. The captain sent most of the pirate ashore and Jim decided at the last moment to go ashore with them. Once there he hid in the wood. So what happened after he had come to know about their plan, captain just sent all the crew members to the ashore. Ashore means at the edge, at the, on the edge of the sea. And they just ran away from that ship. All the members ran away from that ship because they know that captain John Silver is going to kill them. Will's team was hiding, he came across Ben Gunn, an ex-pirate who had been marooned on the island three years ago. So while they just moved away from the ship, Jim Hawkins came across with a person, that person, Ben Gunn. And that Ben Gunn was a member of the Flint crew also. And he was marooned. Marooned means left isolated, left alone. He was left alone there by that crew members and he is living here for the three years since then ben had given up piracy he said to jim and his friends don't worry i will help you so that ben gun decides to help that jim hawkins and his crew members and he even gave his words to them that he left that piracy and now he is an honest person honestly he is going to help them he just take away that persons with him Meanwhile, his friends, don't worry, I will help you. So that Ben Gunn decides to help that Jim Hawkins and his crew members. And he even gave his words to them that he left that piracy and now he is an honest person. Honestly, he is going to help them. He just take away that persons with him. 
Meanwhile, the captain and the others abandoned the Hispaniola and took refuge in an old stockade on the island. So what happened? Abandoned means left refuge means shelter. Stockade means a wall stake built around a piece for defense. So what happened? Meanwhile, the captain and others left the Hispaniola ship and they took a refuge to Ben Gunn's stockade. Stockade means he built a house with the wood and they just take a shelter over there. The pirates suddenly realized that their plan had been discovered and so attacked the captain and the others to get the treasure map. So as the moment these uh, the captain, Smollett, Dr. Levisi and Square and Jim Hawkins left the ship along with the crew members, John Long, Long John Silver just got a hint that we are being caught. They come to know about our plan. So he decided to kill them and take away a map from them. The map is with whom? Jim Hawkins. So he decided to kill all of them and take away the map. However, for the time being, the captain and his crew were safe in the stocking. But now we know that Mengen helped that captain Smollett Dr. Levisi and other crew members now they all are safe in Bengal. Escaped from the stockade and went off without telling the others. He found a boat that Bengal had hidden and then sailed out to the Hispaniola and cut it morning drop. He then fell asleep in the boat, exhausted. Morning means cable by which a ship is held. Exhausted means tired. So, what after that? When they all are taking a rest in Bengal's stockade, on the moment Jim decided to leave the place. He just took away Bengal's ship that Bengal had hide from others and he moved to the Hispaniola, his big ship to that Hispaniola. He just cut the rope of that Hispaniola. Here you can see Jim Hawkins, he is cutting that rope and he just fell asleep in that. But quite obviously, if you cut the rope, if you cut the ship from the it's a tie tired where the tired ship will move with the ocean so it keep on moving and he is just sleeping in that ship in the morning he only just managed to escape from drowning as the sea had become very rough so what happened as the moment he was moving and sleeping in the morning somehow he escaped himself from drowning he is going to be sink in that one Luckily, he spotted the drifting Hispaniola and managed to board her. There were only two pirates on the boat. So what happened? He just managed to be in that Hispaniola and he see that only two pirates were there in the boat. Rest all just left the Hispaniola. There were only two pirates on the boat, one of whom had been killed in a drunken brawl by the other. Brawl means... A noisy quarrel so that two pilots were left on the Hispaniola they just keep on fighting with each other so what happened one just killed the another it means now one person left on that one after a terrifying fight Jim killed the last pirate and managed to steer the ship into a small cove so what happened one is killed by the other and the second was killed by Jim Hawkins and somehow Jim Hawkins managed to take Hispaniola with him cove means a small boy steer means guide, terrifying means dreadful. He then headed back to the stockade to rejoin his friend and after taking that Hispaniola, Jim Hawkins again went back to his friend and he joined their company. The stockade was now in the hands of Long John Silver and his mates. They captured Jim and gave him a choice. Now what happened? As the moment Jim reached to the place that stockade, he watched that Long John Silver attacked that place. We attacked that stockade. So now it means Long John Silver captured his crew members like Dr. Levisi, Smollett, Square and other crew members. Now they all are under his charge. And even they gave a choice to Jim Hawking also. Join us or die. Now he is saying John uh, John Long John Silver is giving his words to Jim Hawkins you have an option either you can join us or otherwise we will kill you 
Chim refused the offer so that pirates wanted to kill him but Silver talked them out of it. So now what happened? Chim just refused their offer. He said he don't want to join your group. So the pirates decided to kill him but Long John Silver just escaped him somehow because he knew that he has a map with him. Silver said to Chim, the doctor has given me the map and also abandoned the stockade in exchange for being allowed to go free. And he said to the gym, Long John Silver said to the gym that doctor has given me the map. He handed me over the map and now that stockade is also under our charge. So it's better to join our. I am on the side of the doctor. At that point, the pirates attempted to give Silver the black spot. But withdraw it when he revealed that he had the map. They agreed to go and find the treasure the next day. So he here is used for Long John Silver and he said that he is now on the side of Dr. Levesey. And after hearing this, his pirates decided to give him a black spot. Black spot means they decided that he is no more their leader. But uh, when he said that, John uh, Long Silver said that he has a treasure map with him, they dropped the idea. So on the next day, they decided to go for the treasure. The treasure hunt began and Jim was dragged along. The weather was hot and sweaty and the pirates were edgy. When they finally reached the spot where the treasure should have been hidden, they discovered a great hole in the ground. Dug quite a while ago for grass had sprouted on the bottom. So what happened when next day just, just went for the treasure, for the discovery of the treasure, they, uh, they took Jim with along. And what they found? They found that someone has already stolen that treasure because there was a big hole in the ground and even the grass is sprouted there. That is an indication it has been taken by someone a year ago so they were very weary they were very tense by that one what happened and even they found a broken x and a board where that word walrus is written so that word walrus means the name of the ship used by captain flint so it means that has been taken by a person who was there in flint's ship Silver immediately realized that there would be trouble and gave Jim a pistol with which to defend himself. So somewhere Silver just understand the intensity of the situation as him. And he secretly gave Jim a pistol to fight on or to defend himself, to save himself. The pirates turned angrily on Silver and were just about to attack him. So the pirates are angry with Silver. They somewhere they consider that Long John Silver has taken away the treasure. And they are just about to attack him when there was a shot from the woods that killed one of them. So when the pirates are about to shot Silver, there was a shot from the back. The doctor and the bengun then appeared. So what was that? The doctor and the bengun appeared from the bushes and the pirates ran off. And on seeing bengun and doctor, the pirates ran off from the situation, heading for the remaining long boat left for the Hispaniola. And they just all left for the boat Hispaniola. Jim and his friends got there first and demolished the boat. Demolished means destroyed. Jim and his friends, what work they did, they just went near to the another boat and they just destroyed it. So, no other persons can sail the boat. At this point, Ben Gunn revealed that he had taken up the treasure several years ago and it was now in his cave. So, what was the main thing that we come to know that Ben Gunn, who, that person who was living there in the jungle, he has taken away all the treasure several years ago and it was safe in his cave. Jim took everyone to the Hispaniola and Jim just took every person to the Hispaniola, that ship. They transported the treasure from the Ben's cave to her hold. So what they did, they just transported all the treasure to that boat, Hispaniola. Silver still claimed to be one on the doctor's side and helped them at every opportunity. Long John Silver, he is still claiming that he is too on the doctor's side and he will help them in every opportunity. But this is not true. Know that he is a cunning person. He is a dishonest person. 
whenever he will get an opportunity he will just play his game finally they set sail and left treasure island so what finally they just left the island taken away the treasure with them and the last couple of pirates behind so they left that corrupted couple of pirates behind them they did not take away them with themselves they first sailed the Hispan uh, Hispaniola to America to get more crewmen and more there for one night. More means crew person. So they just stayed there in America. They just took a rest over there for a night and they looked for another more means another pirate who can sail the ship. In the morning they discovered that silver and some of the treasure had disappeared. That long John Silver when in the morning when they all wake up they found that Silver is not there. He just has taken away his share and disappeared from the situation. Finally they return home. So finally they all return back to home. The captain made full recovery. Bengan became a respectable citizen. So the captain made a full recovery. He has just recovered all his injuries and he has taken away his share. And Bengan even, he, is, he became a respectable citizen. But Jim Swan, I will never go chasing treasure again. But Jim just take a pledge that in his upcoming years, he will never go for a treasure. He will never go to chase a treasure. No one ever heard of Long John Silver again, but they did not get any hearing from Long John Silver. He just taken away his share and settled to somewhere in the other part of the country. So here comes to an end of your chapter. I hope you understood the chapter. Now in today's online class, your teacher will discuss the question answers of this chapter. Till the time, stay safe, stay at home. Thank you.